Time is running out for Jen to reveal her pregnancy to her closest friends. After Jonas died, I didn't get the support from them that I needed. Tonight, she will finally face them and announce her news. I'm nervous for tonight. That's a lot of people. I want to know why they haven't talked to me. Ask them that straight up. Okay. My friends, I mean, really, when it comes down to it, they are my family. I've known them for over a decade now, so I went to school with them. So I know it's going to be a lot of heartache if my friends don't support me. When I walked in the door and saw everyone, I made sure I was holding some food in front of my stomach to cover it up. The first friend that I hugged, she kind of pushed back because she could feel my stomach. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> All right. Good. And then everyone else, I tried to just hug from the side and I sat down really quick. Oh. It's so quiet. I just kept running through my head what I was going to say and how I was going to say it and when I was going to say it. So nervous right now, I think that maybe I wouldn't even reveal my pregnancy to them. I have just under two months left. Oh my gosh. Wow. I bet you're like, woohoo. Yeah, I'm excited this time too because I won't be pregnant all summer like last time. Yeah, so it was so fun. fun. When are you due? You know. <laughs> How did you know? Can you tell? <laughs> oh, but that threw me off with Chantel when she asked me. Yeah, my due date is the same day that Jonas died. Wow. So I did get pregnant really fast. It was 10 weeks later. It's been quite the ride. <laughs> yeah. I just want to hug you. I know. <laughs> well, thank you. That's uh yeah, definitely one of the main reasons I wanted to come here was to reach out because I've been kind of like a hermit recluse and scared out of my mind. But the thing that was so hard after Jonas is I had just complete silence and I felt so isolated and I would put on Facebook some things and I'd announce, you know, that's the easiest way to broadcast it, that he had died. And, and then I'd start to talk more, you know, I'm burying my son today and it was just such low response that I started to get more and more quiet and I got more and more scared. So hard. What? You Facebooked about Jonas. I, like, I was just like, oh my God, why? Like, why does that have to happen? And I couldn't, I thought about it all the time. I'm like, I wish that I had been able to, like, think of some way to come and talk to you because I really did want to. Yeah. I wish I could have. I don't no. want you to feel bad. But that makes me feel better that you were thinking about me every day because oh, I, gosh, no I one's. <laughs> Nobody quite knows the right thing to say when you're going through that. I'm sorry yeah. that that wasn't communicated better.